hey guys welcome back to my channel so today we are going to be making butter cookies today and i'm actually going to be baking with my little nephew so yeah let's get right into this video so guys in a bowl i'm just going to add um, my butter and also i'll be adding my icing sugar i'm using about one and a half cup of icing sugar i'm going to mix this properly until it is a little bit creamy you can actually use your mixer if you have one or you can choose to use your spatula like me i actually wanted to use my spatula anyway so that was why i just resorted to using my spatula so i'm just going to mix this until it is creamy and yeah this is what we have now so yeah guys i'm done so i'm just going to add my all-purpose flour and i'm using three cups of all-purpose flour i'll add this into the mixture and i will mix again so guys i was actually hoping i could use my spatula to mix the flour but at some point i just changed my mind and i now decided to use my hands to mix it just because it makes it much more easier to use your hands when baking most times anyway so yeah i'm just going to use my hands and i'm just going to mix the butter the icing sugar and the all purpose flour together and make sure it mixes properly So now guys, in a bowl, we added one egg and one and a half tablespoonful of vanilla extract. My little nephew is going to mix this properly and when we are done mixing this properly, we'll then add it to our mixed all-purpose flour. And yeah guys, we're adding this to our mixed all-purpose flour and we're going to mix with our hands to create a dough from this mixture so we're not going to add any milk any water nothing we're just going to use the egg and the vanilla extract for the extra flavor and mix this to create a dough guys i've created the perfect dough for my cookies now i'm just going to store this and keep this in the fridge for 30 minutes after 30 minutes i brought out my dough and i'm just going to use um my rolling pin roll this um flat enough not so flat anyways but just a little bit just a little bit flat i'm just going to roll that and then we'll start um cutting the dough into our preferred um, cookies shape. Guys, we are using three different types of shape. We have the star, the love shape, and the circle shape as well the round shape so yeah my little nephew is going to cut this into his preferred shape and he started off with the love shape and then the star shape and then the circle shape so yeah once he's done we're going to create more shapes
So after he has created the shapes, I just took out the edges that were not shaped and yeah, I took it out gently and now we have the star shaped cookies, we have the love shaped cookies, we also have the round shaped cookies as well. So yeah, we're going to continue this um, with the dough, the parts that were not shaped, we're going to remold it, roll it again and create more shaped cookies. guys we're done um, creating our shape cookies so my little nephew wanted to add some chocolates to it so yeah we're just going to add about two chocolates to each cookies just to create um, a fun cookie like yeah a fun cookie anyways so we're just going to do that and when we are done we'll get or we'll see you guys when we're done <laughs> guys our cookies are ready to enter the oven now and we're going to bake at 200 degrees celsius for 15 to 20 minutes so after 15 minutes this is what our cookies is looking like so we're just going to put it back to bake for an extra five minutes just to give it a little bit of crunch guys my cookies are ready now and you can see how perfectly baked it looks and it's also a little bit crunchy as well which is what i like so guys you can see how crunchy it looks so um thank you guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel bye guys <music>